Well, ticks are responsible for carrying Lyme disease. Now, there are an estimate of 300,000 new cases in the U.S. each year, according to the CDC. And you don't have to live in wooded areas to contract the disease. You do not. I spoke with famous designer Genevieve Gorder about the battle she faced with Lyme disease and why it's important to understand anyone, anywhere, anytime can get it and what you need to do to prevent it. This is the perfect time to talk about it as we are entering May, which is Lyme Disease Awareness Month. Um, I live in New York, a hotbed for uh, Lyme disease, and now affects all 50 states prevalently. Um, I contracted Lyme disease about nine years ago, and I didn't find a bullseye, I didn't find a tick, and less than 50% do. So keep that in mind. Um, you don't have to see a tick to know you have Lyme disease. However, in the next eight or nine months after being bitten, um, I came down with a myriad of symptoms that were bizarre from, you know, my face feeling paralyzed, to my tongue feeling burnt, to all my nerves going off like pins and needles, to um, joint pain. And it wasn't until we got to joint pain, like in the eighth or ninth month, that I said we need to test for, for Lyme more prevalently because you can only test positive for Lyme disease when it's in bloom. Imagine it like a little flower in your body, a terrible flower, and when it's in bloom every four to six weeks, that's the only time you'll get a positive response on a test for Lyme disease. Tuesday could be negative, Wednesday could be positive. Wow. So and we, be a vigilante. Yeah, and you know, when you think about it, it, we talk about ticks, and I think people just, they think, oh, I live in the city, or I don't go out in the woods. I'm not going to be, you know, exposed to that. How do people, um, you know, keep ticks out of their lives, basically? Well, first of all, that's a totally false way to think as I live in Manhattan and I have Lyme disease and yeah. I got it in New York. Um, ticks are tiny and they can live on any blade of grass or any leaf in any city anywhere. Yes, if you're walking through tall grass, it is a little bit more prevalent for sure. A good way to start protecting yourself is why I'm here today. I'm partnered with Terminex um, to really bring awareness to their new tick defend system. Over 75% of all Lyme Lyme disease cases are contracted in and around someone's house. So that yard area is where you spend the majority of your outdoor time. It's not when you're walking through the forest or on that five mile hike. You may do that once in a while. Majority of time is in your yard. So in these hotter months, June and July are the big months for Lyme disease in which we contract it the most. And over 300,000 people a year in our country alone are getting Lyme disease. So this is not just a little thing. This is an epidemic. Um, and this is a first barrier to do, much like we've been doing with mosquitoes for decades. You get sprayed once, or if you live in a very tick-heavy tick area, you can get sprayed monthly. And 10% of all the proceeds from the, from the Terminac Tick Defense System go to the Global Lyme Alliance, which is a great non-for-profit that has incredible information about Lyme prevention, awareness, etc. Yeah, that's what I want to make sure we get in is that during this month, people can get themselves protected and give to a cause that is also very worthwhile. So where can our viewers go if they want to learn more about this? First, go to Terminex.com and figure out how to armor your house, much like a security system does. Do that first so you don't get Lyme. Second, Global Lyme Alliance is a great non-for-profit that offers all the information, education, and research you would need about Lyme disease, how to protect your kids, your family, and yourself. And before we wrap up, I must ask quickly, where can people follow you? And more importantly, what's new with you real quick? Well, you can always find me on Instagram, Genevieve Gorder. I'm there and I'm telling you what I'm doing all the time. But I have a new series launching um, on Bravo this Wednesday called Best Room Wins. Um, it's a really sexy new show with El Decor magazine. Um, and I think everyone's really going to like it. 10 o'clock Eastern on Bravo this Wednesday.